Salam sejahtera Om Swastiastu Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Shalom nama budaya Ladies and gentlemen We've gone through so many global hardships in our lives And as I am speaking right now We are still going through one The COVID-19 pandemic It has negatively impacted our lives such as our health, our economy. However, in this chance, I won't have you dwell over those bad things. Instead, I'm going to have you look at the silver lining. Breathe in, breathe out. Relax and concentrate. Now, imagine the world where we wouldn't have to worry about another financial crisis happening again in the future. A world where the current human population can meet their own needs without thinking so hard if these resources will still be available for the next generation without having to become so much more expensive. Wait, hold on, hold on. That is way too good to be true. Well, of course, but at least we're actually working on it. Economic growth without having to damage natural resources. Sustainable finance. I am Teresia Putusalika Marzino, and I will tell you about a ray of hope for the future of this world, for the future of Indonesia. Big vision big action, and big transformation. Note these words spoken by our President Joko Widodo as Indonesia hosts the G20 presidency. Before we dive deeper, let's start from the surface. Does G20 still sound unfamiliar to you? Well, to put it simply, the Group of 20 or G20 is an international body that promotes economic cooperation between industrialized and developing countries. The G20 comprises the European nation and 19 countries, including Indonesia. That means this body represents more than 80% of the world GDP, 75% of international trade, and 60% of the world population. So G20 holds an important role in securing our global financial growth and prosperity. You may wonder, we're living in the present and the problems we have are already so overwhelming. What's up with the future now? Can't they just take care of the current problems that we're actually facing right now? Well, ladies and gentlemen, and most importantly, teenagers around my age. We need to stop and think of how ambitious businessmen all over the world could be without thinking about nature. Sure, they do help the growth of our economy, but the impact of economic growth includes increased use of non-renewable resources, higher levels of pollution, global warming, and the loss of environmental or natural habitats. Right now, the adults may overlook those impacts, but you, as the future generation, including me, will be the most affected. Obviously, we wouldn't want a future like that, don't we? That is why G20 exists. If you're updated with the news, Indonesia takes the G20 presidency. Let's give a round of applause for our beloved country. This year, they have this heartwarming theme. Recover together, recover stronger. Indonesia invites the world to work together, to recover together, and to grow stronger and sustainably together. With Indonesia as chairman of G20, our economy can be seen as resilient towards the crisis amid the ongoing pandemic. Indonesia 
becomes a representative for other developing countries, as right now our country is the main international focus. And not just that, as G20 meetings will be held in our country, Indonesia, rises an opportunity for us to showcase our local products and tourism sector to the world in hopes that we can revive our national economy. Ladies and gentlemen, as the world leaders take action, do we just sit back and watch? Totally no, that will be boring anyway, right? That is why in this chance, I encourage our fellow Indonesian citizens to take part in this movement. Indonesian artist Madi Ainda has become an official bridge for us to receive information about G20 agendas. Maximize that opportunity and put your thoughts into it. Give constructive criticism or simply spread the word and educate others. And last but not least, let us all give our prayers towards G20 and their agendas in hopes that everything will go as planned for a better future of this world, for a better future of Indonesia. Thank you so much for your attention. Remember, always do something today that your future self will thank you for. Recover together, recover stronger. Salam sejahtera. Om Santi 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 Om. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Shalom Namo Buddhaya.